ya kitaifa ya uwiano na utangamano nchini imeandaa kikao cha kutathmini masuala ya amani baada ya uchaguzi mkuu katika kaunti ya Kwale. Tume hiyo inasema imeanzisha mchakato wa kuwachukulia hatua watakaopatikana na makosa ya kueneza matamshi ya chuki na vile vile uchochezi kwenye mitandao ya kijamii. Lawrence Nganga anaarifu zaidi kutoka Kwale. Kikao kilichoandaliwa na tume ya uiano na utangamano nchini NCIC wananchi wametakiwa kudumisha amani hata baada ya uchaguzi mkuu kukamilika tume hiyo ikisisitiza kuwa amani iliyoshuhudiwa wakati wa uchaguzi mkuu uliopita inafaa kuigwa katika chaguzi zijazo tumeona ya kwamba tunaweza fanya uchaguzi we can politic we can vote tuhesabu kura tutangaze and we remain peaceful as a country That is what we saw in this election of 2022. Kikao hicho kilichojumuisha washikadau kutoka idara ya usalama, mashirika ya kijamii, viongozi wa kidini na viongozi wa kisiasa, washikadau wameahidi kuwaleta wananchi pamoja hasa wakati huu ambapo wengi wanaponya makovu ya uchaguzi uliopita. Sasa so naona mimi sijawahi kuona uchaguzi watu wanafanya post election healings. Hii ni kumaanisha kwamba roho ziliumia sana hata kama watu wa kupigana lakini tu niseme wanafanya kazi nzuri bila amani hakuna maendeleo tunataka tu encourage wa kwale wote wajue yule ameku, amekuwa elected kama governor ndio governor wetu yule ambaye alikuwa elected kama president so that we can see the Kenya in a move in one direction tume ya NCIC imesema inawasaka watu wanaoeneza semi za chuki na uchochezi katika mitandao ya kijamii idara ya usalama ikiahidi kushirikiana na tume hiyo wakabili washukiwa we have a cohesion monitors uh, what we call cohesion monitors in this county there are people here working for the commission who are monitoring that and so you very soon you will see so many cases of hate speech in court uh, our cohesion monitor might even be in, the, in a member of those groups so as as people misbehave they will find themselves in court tafadhali sana hizo nguvu ambazo tunazo huo ujuzi ambao tunao hata wa kutumia mitandao tutumie katika kuangalia masuala mengine ya kijamii ambayo yanakandamiza jamii yetu malengo ya serikali ni kuona kwamba kila mtu anajihisi kuwa mkwale haijalishi wewe ni kabila gani hiyo mambo tulisika kutoka kaunti ya kwale mimi ni Lawrence Nganga